I just met with a historian at your library. We talked, that, you know, about the history of Eliza Hart Spalding. Have you heard of her? Oh, yeah. No. Yes. What's the what's the story yeah. of Spalding? Well, they're one of the founding families. It started Brownsville. They're, they uh -huh. came here from over the um, from out west. Um, from out east. East, I mean, from the east to the west. Right. And I think they came from Missouri or Illinois, maybe. Yeah, I think Illinois. I think Illinois. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I get her confused with my family that came from Missouri. Huh? Okay. Anyway. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and um, they settled in the area. There were several families. There were the, the Kirks that came later. There was the Spaldings and the Browns. Hmm. And, um, which Brownsville is named which after. Brownsville right. is named after, and it could have been named um, Kirksville, or it could have been uh -huh. named a few other things, but they... Spaldingville. Um, could have been Spaldingville, but they are the town of Spalding. Yeah. And they... Rumor has it, legend has it, that they flipped a coin, but nobody's really certain if that's really how the Browns won uh -huh. the I honor of getting the it name. It seemed rivalrous between the Browns and the Kirks, is the, yeah, what it, I remember. And it could have been. Huh? I think they were even distantly related. Oh. You, you're distantly related to them? No, I'm not. <laughs> oh, 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 okay. The Browns and the Kirks may have been distantly related. Because when people, a lot of times when they migrated like that in a group, a lot of times they were actually related. Yes. You know, whole families would just up and go. Right. Mm -hmm. Well, um, I, I've connected them with the Hart family in, in Connecticut. Mm -hmm. And they're related to William and Harry Windsor uh -huh. through the Spencer family. Uh -huh. So the whole royal, fam the royal thing family thing ends right here. Wow. They, they went west, this family. Uh, they had the... Uh, the the, the, the pioneering spirit, you know, and they, she was one of the first to cross the Rockies. Wow. You know, and they, they went through a massacre with the Indians and stuff like Interesting. that. Interesting. Well, yeah. you know, if you want to get some uh, more history on the place, the person to talk to is uh, Greg Hoopla at, down at the Kirk's Ferry restaurant. Oh, yeah, I, hear, I heard about them. Yeah, yeah, I'm heading there next, actually. Oh, yeah, you Greg definitely. Hoopla. Greg. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Greg Hoopla. Yeah. Yeah. And he's the grandson of um, Kirk, great-great-grandson of the okay. Kirks that settled this area, Kirk's Ferry. Okay. And the original cabin, <clears throat> the original Kirk's Ferry cabin, which was also like a little um, way station where people could stay the night and so forth and get fresh horses and, and had a stable and such. Uh-huh. And also had the ferry crossing. That's why it's called Kirk's Ferry. Yeah. Um, the original cabin is inside the restaurant. Now, how far down is that? I just go down to the end of the street here to the stop sign, you make a right, and then right next to the um, Chevron station uh -huh. on the left-hand side, you're going to make a left into there, and you can see there's big metal cutouts of horses and stuff, Huge. and it looks wow. like a hitching track. So that's about three blocks away. Yeah, right? yeah. exactly. Well, yeah. the epiphany that I had was I see there's a lot of stores closed, beautiful Victorian storefronts closed. <laughs> you two, you two are, you, 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 you're the only life that thing that's happening in this town, right? Is that you, do you want to talk with your mouth full with it? Yes, uh, I, I love it, I, I love it. Peter. It's too thin. No. Yeah, right. You so I thought maybe, you know, i come here and open up a gallery or something like that. But that's expensive, you know, you got to pay money and all that. There's three buildings over there. I saw, empty. I saw them. I'm opening up a gallery, it's not... <clears throat> But then I realized it's it's the economy, you know, that mm -hmm. you know people aren't coming here and spending money like they used to. The bank's going to be empty. They're moving out. They they are. The bank, the yep. bank, after June sixth, okay. they're gone. They won. Can try to get in another bank now. I heard. Yeah. Good luck. You know, Key Bank doesn't want to be here. You know, what other bank is going to want? Okay. Well, here's here's my epiphany. I come walking into here after th dreaming about uh. having one of these storefronts. And, and Kelly, I, I meet Kelly, and he's on the internet. Were you just in there talking to him? I was in there earlier talking to him. Oh. So, so, so he was putting up all these little Hot Wheels up for, for sale mm -hmm. on the internet, and all of a sudden, yeah. the light bulb went off. Jeez. Okay, virtual Brownsville. People are spending billions and billions of dollars shopping on the internet. Brownsville, you know, you go to Brownsville, you're going to go to all these little shops, you could go bank at the bank, you can, you know. You're saying? What? Virtually? Yes. Use the storefronts, you don't even have to put people in here, 
to rent things, or, but people will want to. Once Brownsville be becomes vir the virtual place to shop for antiques and, and history, okay, yeah. people will come here. The yeah, first, it's like a really wide meaning of virtual, right? Huh? Or are you thinking of doing like literal virtual tour, like absolutely? Here, like, in a city. I actually have company. Yeah. Oh, right. So, okay. Well, nice okay. to meet you. Uh, uh, well, sis, <laughs> Art's calling me too. Yeah. Uh, I have uh, to uh, uh, can I have your name? I'm Gail. Hi, Gail. Very. Glad to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Hey, what's this your name? Sally. You can call me Sally. Sally? Yeah. All right. And, and you own this little shop over here? Okay. Is, hey, can, 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 you, can you give me a little tour of what you're doing? Um, Are you no, private? Not yet. Oh, okay. Not yet. So you live around here, right? No, I live in Springfield. Oh, okay. So it that, sounds that, like is that around here? Yeah, it's in Oregon. Okay.